Today, we learn how to set up and use the text-to-speech YP scripts for WISE. Let's go. So first, the whole project is on GitHub. So you can browse the source code and also uh, look at the instructions for uh, the setup. And first thing is that you need to have Windows uh, to use this program. Also, you need to have Python 3.6 or more recent. And, and next, we'll be installing the YP Python uh, client. So we'll copy this command over here. So that installs the YP client uh, using the Python installer. And we are done. So next thing we need to do is to create the add-ons directory under the app data folder. So let's do that right now. So I'll create a new directory and add-ons. Let's go in the directory then. Uh, next thing we'll download the entire repository from GitHub. Once this is done, we will unzip the files in the add-on directory. So, so we have our add-ons here is empty and we go in the zip file and we copy the commands, yp text to speech and readme files in, on the add-on directory. So we're done with that. So at this point, we're ready to load the command in WISE. So, to tell WISE that we have a new command, uh, we'll be using the search field on top of the toolbar and type greater sign to search commands and then uh, reload. So we'll find command add on reload and we click that. So now our command uh, was loaded. Um, so let's create a sound now. Type hello. And the text-to-speech system is using the notes field for the text to generate. So let's um, type hello, Bernard, and right-click the sound. And now we have the generate text-to-speech menu here, which is uh, coming from the command we just installed. So let's run that. So this is actually generating a WAV file on the original folder. And now we see the hello sound is now blue. And we have the WAV file imported and we can actually play back. Hello, Bernard. So now let's take a look at the source code for this. So we will be opening our folder with Visual Studio Code. and. Let's take a look at the different files found on the fold, uh, in the folder. So we have our JSON file uh, that defines the command generate text-to-speech here. It tells WISE what to run when we execute the command. So here we have our Python script and also the ID of the selected objects from WISE. Next, we have the actual Python script which is a YP script. So first thing the script does is it asks WISE, I have this ID, now tell me the name, the notes type, and is the sound a voice and also the path. And then it gets the information and then you can proceed with the rest of the script. So let's close this. Okay. Uh, now it runs the PowerShell from Windows to execute the speech synthesizer. And that will generate a WAV file. And from this WAV file, we're able to uh, create import uh, instructions for WISE. So we have the WAV file, 
the where in the project we want to place the sound. And then we use the import function to trigger the import of the WAV file. And there it is, we have our WAV file imported to WISE. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed and see you.